is up you guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is hannah if you're not new welcome back today i am mixing up the content a little bit i'm actually going to do a fall 2020 thrift flip and therefore i'm going to several different thrift stores in my area today to find different fall outfits that i like or like fall items that i like and then i'm going to flip them for you guys on camera i got a lot of this inspiration from pinterest i also got some inspiration from some websites i was searching the other day like misguided urban outfitters lulu's and i just realized like when looking on those websites that yes i could pay 70 dollars for like a flannel and a sweater or a sweatshirt or i could save the the environment and go to a thrift store and try to find the exact same things I was looking at online or similar items and make it myself and make a cool video out of it. So therefore, we went with option B. Instead of buying it online and paying $10 for shipping, we are thrift flipping. So without further ado, let's get this video started. I hope you guys enjoy. What's up you guys? It is several days later. I obviously washed all the clothes. I let them dry and now I'm finally having time to getting around to actually flipping them. But before I flip them, I wanted to show you guys what I got from the thrift store. I only got three items. That's like a decent thrift day in my mind is to find at least three items. So the first thing that we have is this amazing, amazing, amazing flannel. This is actually a J. Crew flannel that I'm pretty sure I got for five bucks, I think. I think I got this for like five dollars. I'm really excited for this. I love the colors. It's like navy and this peach color and I'm planning on acid or bleach dipping this. So I'm planning on dipping the bottom of this in bleach to make it sort of like a faded look and I'm really, really excited for this one. The next thing that I got from the thrift store is this Washington Capitals shirt. If you guys don't know, I am from the DC area and so these shirts are really easy to come across in the thrift store and I actually don't have an Washington capital shirt and I also am planning on using bleach on this but I'm not planning on dipping it I'm planning on making like a little tie-dye situation so I'm super excited to see how this one turns out as well the last item that I got is this green shirt I got from the men's section and it still had the tags on it when you find a shirt in a thrift store that still has the tags on it it's literally like Christmas morning I think they got this shirt for like 10 bucks and it was originally 30 or 40 the brand is Hathaway. I've never heard of that brand, but I just love the material of this and I also love the color. I'm not entirely sure what I'm gonna do with it yet. I may crop it or I might tie eye it. Honestly, then I'm gonna leave this one for last to see if I have some inspiration when doing the other two. But yeah, those are the three items that I got from the thrift store and now let's get to actually flipping them. Look up from your telescope, take me on this journey home, I don't wanna wait no more. Lay me down behind the moon, tell me you'll be on real soon, I don't wanna wait no more. We could be dancing in the stars, we could be floating all the way, as long as I'm safely in your arms. And it don't really matter where we stay Don't pass space Space makes me sad Cause All 
Alrighty, hello guys. We are back with the final product. This took so long for me to film. I think it's literally a month after I thrifted, two weeks after I did the flip, and now I finally have the final products for you guys. So the first one that I want to show you was kind of a fail. And I'm still going to show you it because I think it's kind of cool the way it turned out. It just looks kind of like vintage and worn, which, you know, that can be a vibe. So the first shirt that I have to show you guys is actually the shirt that I'm wearing. It is the Washington Capitals shirt. I tried to bleach dye this as you guys saw in the previous footage and it just didn't turn out and I almost kind of wish that I didn't dye this shirt or I hadn't tried to dye this shirt because I like the way it was before and I didn't know it would be turn out like this, but now it kind of looks like vintage. The next shirt that I have for you guys is the flannel. So this flannel, we also don't know how to feel about it, but I feel like it kind of turned out as a vibe also. Like this, these types of flannels are very in right now. So as you saw in the video, I dipped half of the flannel in the bleach. So this is how it looks. Like I said, I don't know how I love it, but at the end of the day, I think that it's super trendy and it's in right now and it would look really cute with a pair of leggings and a t-shirt underneath it or just like a pair of sweatpants or I can just lounge around the house in this. The final shirt that I have for you guys is the green shirt and I did not touch this shirt. I did not want to touch this shirt because I will pop in the picture here. I put it on and it fit perfectly as an oversized t-shirt dress and I did not want to ruin that. I've been looking for a nice oversized t-shirt dress for a while and when I put it on with a pair of booties that I see you guys saw in that picture, I was just like, this is the look. Like this is the whole look that we are going for. This is a vibe, this is the mood. I cannot touch this shirt because I know if I touch the shirt, I'm gonna ruin it. So we left the shirt completely be and now it is an oversized t-shirt dress that I can wear with booties and I'll of course like put biker shorts or something under it just in case little slippage you know what I mean that is how these three shirts turned out I definitely encourage you guys to thrift if you've never thrift before if you put it off for a while because not only is it like a really good way to save the environment but it's also like a way to be creative and transform pieces if you're super into that hopefully your, your guys's pieces turn out a little bit better than mine did or you just like have a better eye for it than I do. I do like the way the pieces turn out nonetheless and I cannot wait to wear them. I encourage you guys to thrift and I encourage you guys to flip and I encourage you guys to get creative because you know in quarantine there's not much we can do. So with all that being said I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was a lot different than the rest of my videos. I've been doing a lot of vlogs lately like I mentioned and I just wanted to mix up the content. So if you guys like videos like this let me know so I can do more in the future or if you have any other video recommendations for me let me know down below so that I can add them to the list so I can film them. If you guys are not subscribed already, don't forget to subscribe down below. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.